When we began to enter in to 2017, God put on our heart, according to these two passages of scripture, that to declare that this be a year of release. The Bible says in Isaiah 55 that no word from God will be able to return void, but it will accomplish what it has been sent to do. I believe with all of my heart that 2017 is going to be a year when the presence of God performs an all-out assault on this earth and we see heaven released. Telling me if I'm a releasing something this year, then you need to take my word on the release thing. And you need to let go of what's holding you back from seeing what I'm doing and what I'm about to do in your life and ministry. Because if you're not careful, you're gonna keep looking over here and you're gonna miss the moment and the season that I'm about to bring into your life and bring across your path. destiny that knows that God is about to do Ephesians 3.20 in your life that he's about to do exceedingly abundantly above somebody scream above more than you can even imagine or even think you to think that you have to prove yourself to anyone prove yourself or compare yourself to anybody else all you're supposed to do the Bible says is you're supposed to look at the Word of God If you know every giant in your life in 2017, God says that thing has got to come down and the world will know the power of your God. Yeah, yeah, God put the desire for you to have better. Don't let anybody, don't let anybody kill that desire. You're supposed to have better. It does not matter what 
they say. It doesn't matter what they think. It doesn't matter what they say. You got to stay in your lane and understand that you have a purpose.